This is the video update for the Unitarian Church of Lincoln. Today is Tuesday, December 20th, 2022. It is Christmas week here at the Unitarian Church. We have our Christmas Eve service on Saturday at 5.30. And this year it'll be a different way of telling the story of Christmas than the one that we told this past Sunday with the pageant. On Christmas Eve we'll do a more traditional le um, service of lessons and carols, alternating between music and scripture to tell the story of Jesus' birth. We haven't done a lessons and carols service while I've been here, and I'm excited to, to share that particular tradition here at the church. It's a beautiful um, service that, that has been done for about a hundred years, first in Episcopal churches and then uh, across denominations, including our own. You know, in past years we've done Christmas Eve intentionally as an all-ages service, and this isn't really that. We did the, the all-ages way of telling the story this past Sunday. I want to share uh, an email um, from one of my colleagues that she sent out, um, where she, she wrote to her congregation, um, Your children may be bored at the Christmas Eve service. Please bring them to it anyway, if it fits your family's schedule. There are so many reasons for them to be here. Boredom stimulates creativity and a rich inner life. It teaches us to engage ourselves. This is a community of all ages, and all of us need time together. We absorb feelings and information even when we're not paying attention. We'll be rewarded at the end of the service with the magic of candlelight. And last, and this is probably the most important piece, over time, if we bring our kids anyway, because this is what we do on Christmas Eve, kids will come to anticipate the wonder of candles and even maybe look forward to some of the readings and carols. That's why I'll have Ayla here, even though she will almost certainly be bored. She'll hopefully remember 20 years from now that this is what we do on Christmas Eve. This is the story we tell. These are the words that we use to tell it. So that's Saturday. On Sunday morning, which is Christmas morning this year, um, I've uh, sent the staff home. So I'll be at the church on Sunday morning for anyone that wants to gather. Um, if you come, just uh, bring your, your favorite Christmas or winter story. Um, I'll be here with coffee brewing and probably an ugly sweater, and we'll just take turns telling stories and, and maybe singing some songs if we have somebody that can play the piano. Until then, um, stay warm, stay safe. Um, it's supposed to be awfully cold out the next couple days, and I will see you this weekend.